county could be paralyzed in the coming weeks if a standoff between the county government and the Kenya Medical Practitioners, Pharmacists and Dentists Union, KMPDU, Central Branch, is not resolved. The union has threatened to call a strike if their grievances are not heard, saying they have exhausted all the diplomatic avenues. And joining us now is Martin Munene with the latest from Nyeri. Martin, how would this affect the health services if they are to down their tools now? Right. A uh, very good morning to you, Trevor. Uh, and indeed, uh, we are at a time when the country is facing a pandemic. And therefore, uh, when even a single medic uh, or, or practitioner leaves their, uh, you know, their, their, their place or their station, then it would have a devastating effect. Because, for example, in Muranga, one of the challenges that already uh, they are facing or one of the reasons they're having complaints is the shortage of medics. They say uh, that the, the ratio, uh, doctor-patient ratio, is at uh, about 1 to 17,000. And therefore, when one doctor uh, or one, uh, one, one, one doctor moves away, it means that that ratio will definitely change. And therefore, there is a dire need to have more medics. But that is just one of the problems that the doctors in Moranga are having uh, or, or, or are having with the county government of, of uh, Moranga. They say another thing or another challenge they're having is the issue of promotions. And also, uh, they have a problem with uh, how much money they are paid and when they are paid. And we did speak to the uh, secretary of uh, the doctors' union in central Kenya. And this is what she had to say concerning what is going on in Moranga. As we speak right now, we do not have an anesthesiologist to man the ICU. We do not have a pathologist to, my, to, my, to, to man the, um, the mortuary. And we do not have an oncologist to man the cancer center that they have created. Now, as health workers in Moranga, they are very demotivated because they come and offer specialized services and get paid as junior doctors. That is quite unacceptable for us. There is also a grave shortage of health workers. The doctor-patient ratio is 1 to 17,000, yet WHO recommends 1 to 1,000. We also have an issue with the infrastructure. We do not have critical infrastructure that is needed for, for patient care. These patients in Mashinani, they have no other option but the doctors that they have in their health facilities. And we feel like we have taken an oath to give the highest attainable standard of health care and we are not able to do so. We are very frustrated and we've been talking to the county for a long time now and we feel like we have, we have exhausted the diplomacy way and now we are saying that if in the next seven days they don't address our issues, we are going to issue a strike notice and we will not go back until we get our promotion letters, the designation letters and we get the shortage addressed. Even as I say this, uh, as they refuse to promote the healthcare workers who have worked in that county for so long, they are busy advertising the same posts at a higher job group. So our question is, what is the reason for such a discriminatory employment? Now, these doctors, Trevor, say they are giving the county government, Omoranga, a seven-day uh, period in which they can be able to talk and negotiate and resolve these issues. But they say if this does not happen, then they are going to be calling for a strike and they are going to be putting their uh, tools of trade down. And of course, uh, like I said earlier, this will have a devastating effect, especially now that the counties and the country at large are facing a pandemic. Uh, we'll be following up this story, Trevor, to just keep you updated on what is exactly happening if, for example, the doctors and the county government of Moranga can come on the table and actually agree. Uh, and, uh, uh, you know, I, I bring it back to in studio, Trevor, from Nere County, Martin Munene. All right, thanks, Martin. That's Martin Munene speaking to us about the latest.